maintaining focus and staying productive is challenging for most people at the moment. So today I wanted to share three kind of tips with you to help you to stay more focused and maintain that productivity. And these three tips are all around helping us to manage our interruptions. And let's face it, working from home, as many of us are doing, or even working in busy office environments, is actually really quite challenging. And it's very difficult at the best of times to manage those interruptions. So my three tips. First of all, emails. Switch your emails off. Only check emails maybe three times a day. Communicate that with people that need to know. Let people know you only check your emails at 10 o'clock, 2 o'clock and 4 o'clock. But don't be afraid to switch emails off. Switch off email notifications. Close down your emails completely is even better. Setting yourself boundaries and again communicating those boundaries. Let if you're working from home and perhaps you've got your partner working from home, children homeschooling, and perhaps you're all having to share the kitchen table. Think about how you can actually do that. Is it a case of actually sharing and swapping around, being flexible with the times that you're actually working? Is it a case of is there a quiet space that you can go to escape to where when you go to that quiet space, people know not to disturb you unless it's an absolute emergency and the other thing is to say no it's okay to say no sometimes if somebody wants something from you immediately and you're not in the best place you perhaps focus doing something at that time just politely say no because at the end of the day you're not going to give them your very best of attention and therefore you're not giving them the best attention that they deserve so it's better to say no I know some of these things can sound quite scary and depending on your behavioural preference, some of us, as an ever ready myself, I'm quite a direct person and I will quite happily say no. But I, And I will quite happily turn my emails off and just answer emails at certain times of the day. But I know for some of my other colleagues who are a different personality, a different behavioural preference, that is quite a scary thing to do. But the thing to remember is that very often... The expectations we place on ourselves are far greater and far higher than expectations other people have of us. Human beings, we are tribal, tribal beings. And the way that we validate ourselves, we need to feel that we belong. And we need to feel, therefore, that people need us. So by telling ourselves that we couldn't possibly switch those emails off, is actually a way of validating ourselves and our self-worth. So therefore, it's a bit of a built-in natural instinct, a part of our survival instinct, to feel a little bit worried and concerned about switching those emails off and only responding to emails at certain times, about saying no to people. These can be all scary situations for some people. But please try it. Because people that I know, and myself included, that do do these things, we will tell you how much more focused we're able to be, how much more productive we're able to be. So please give it a go. Try, think about setting those boundaries. Try turning off those emails, closing those emails down from time to time and just checking them at set times. But the key to it all is communication.